Well, after four weekends of work, I finally got my Astrodome. Everything you see here, $25. Out of a 62 Chrysler 300, I believe. I think it was a 62. Pulled out of Selma, North Carolina, in the middle of a uh, junkyard. <clears throat> the car was completely wasted. There's no restoring it. Uh, back end strip. There's no floors whatsoever. Was hit by a tree, so the middle's crushed in. Every bit of trim has been pulled off of it. The interior's completely gone. Like there's nothing in there. They have took it all. This was the last thing, really, other than the engine itself. And the engine is just a 413, but it's a it's a really beat up 413, so it's not worth much either. But this was a gem. <clears throat> I've been looking for one of these for a little while and had probably walked by it four or five times and am just astounded that I was found it. <clears throat> I'll pull all this out and clean it. The hard part is going to be finding a reproduction dome. But I'll get all that working back there. Got your turn signals and speedometer. Everything seems to be free, like nothing's locked up except for the amp, which I don't know if it's supposed to naturally rest in the middle. Parking brake light. That's the mileage on the car. 708690. Um, yeah, it's got oil, temp, fuel, amps, speedometer, odometer, no tag. <clears throat> I believe, let's see, they, they say this one's your dome light, and then I think this one's your dash light, and then one of them was your windshield wiper. This was your lights for your actual panel. Uh, wiper that was there. This was controlling your um, mirrors with the cables. That was fun. I had to cut through that. They were gone. No point in saving it. Uh, this is all radio stuff. No radio. Um, <coughs> glove boxes rotted out. I pulled. I pulled some other stuff though. Um, center emblem from the steering wheel. Steering wheel is wasted. Chrome bar. I, I don't know. That just. It's kind of cool looking. Maybe something someday. Or a really nice looking towel rack. <laughs> now just mount it up on the wall or something. I don't know. Uh, pulled this. This was your tranny. Push button tranny. Um, mounts like this actually. But I'm probably going to repurpose it and use it for indicators. Pretty cool. It used this. Um, I guess you'd call it fiber optic. The light enters here. Travels down the plastic. And is portrayed out of that. This is reverse. That's not focused enough, but that will light up. <clears throat> this is all the gears. It was an automatic, but it neutral and one, two, drive. Uh, this was, I think, heating and cooling. Yeah, heat and cooling right here. You can see the little the single bulb is right here. Where's that at? Maybe that's it. Anyway. Here's another one I have. <clears throat> the trim that goes around it, I have both of those. That one on the glove box. But tomorrow the task will be to pull off all of this, because it's worthless. And uh, pull off all of this foam. It's still soaked, it was pouring rain all day. But I went out there anyway and pulled it. Uh, pull this off. And uh, really all I need is from here to here. Because I have an idea. I want to restore this. Restore this, not this. And take this section out and replace it with the instrument cluster in my 87 Ford Escort. 
Why? Because this is in too bad of shape to put back in a Chrysler. Also, I don't want to sell it, so I'm just stupid for not wanting to make money. And uh, the other thing is, I think it's really cool. And an Escort needs uh, needs some new parts anyway, so why not why not put something cool in here? Got all the wiring, and they let me nick all of that. Like I said, this car's wasted. <clears throat> it's all to do with the transmission. But what I am curious about is these run off of high voltage speedometer. Uh, it's electroluminescent lighting, meaning there's no light bulbs other than for the parking brake. Everything that's green lights up, and those numbers, I believe, light up. And um, these down here light up. I think the blinkers were actually light bulbs. But anyway, all this is electroluminescent, which is kind of like those green night lights, the flat ones, everyone's seen them. And it uses high voltage, but I don't know where the transformer's located. And I looked all over the front of the car, and I know it's in the dash area. I looked all over the front um, firewall, didn't see anything, so... This thing's pretty heavy. I'm assuming it's somewhere in here. I just need to go through it. So tomorrow, I'm going to pull this out and clean it. And uh, I need to know where I can get a reproduction uh, bit of plastic here. Because that's going to be the expensive part, I fear. Um, but if all of this works, it would be awesome. Uh, the only other thing is I don't know converting... I don't even know the gear ratios for that speedometer.